Hey Brooklyn, my name's Matt, I'm 26, and I'm super excited to meet you and go paddleboarding with you tonight. Okay guys, I'm headed to date number four. I just finished doing my makeup, but um, honestly, I think I'm gonna have to rebraid this because it's kind of a mess. But date number four, guys, I'm almost halfway there. This is so crazy. It's so insane how like every date is different. Like every guy is different. And I'm so really excited about today's date because it's gonna be really fun. I don't know much about the guy, but uh, yeah. Also, I'm wearing, I don't know if you can see, but I'm wearing like this little giraffe print swimsuit, which is the first time I've ever worn a giraffe print swimsuit. So uh, if this guy doesn't appreciate my cute suit, you guys can appreciate my cute suit. I haven't really been on a lot of water dates before, which then made me have to sit there and think like, do I put makeup on? Because normally if I'm going swimming and stuff, like if I'm in the water, I'm the kind of person that will like legitimately swim. And I will like legitimately like paddle or do all those things. So like my first thought process is like, oh, I'm not gonna wear makeup because I don't want it to get everywhere. But like usually I can put on some like snooze door and it stays on pretty well. But if I'm doing stuff like surfing, like I'll just not wear makeup, but this is also a date. So like, so I ended up just putting on like light makeup for all these water dates. We'll see, date number four, here we come. We are going back up the canyon for this date. I know that this guy's name is Matthew. Yep. He's 26 and he- Wait, he referred to him as himself as Matt, just barely. Oh, so, sorry, so like Matt. A I don't know if he's a training to be a pilot or is a pilot. It's kind of funny because I come from like fifth generation pilots, like my grandpa. Oh my gosh, guess what he is? He's a twin. Oh yeah, I, we don't know if he's identical or not. So that'll be kind of a fun talking point because not everybody can relate to that. We are actually again running late. <laughs> Crap, <laughs> cones. We There's literally so have been in traffic every single day. We've been in like construction. And we've been and leaving earlier yeah, too. Yeah, we have been. We've been leaving like 45 minutes early for every day. So do not judge us. We're doing our best. I saw a few of y'all that were like, how old would you actually date? I think the parameters I set for this were like 21 to 28. Honestly, I'm kind of open-minded about age. I think if you just get along really well, it's all good. So this guy's 26 and I'm really pumped and uh, we'll see how it goes. That's why Hi. I hopped out. Hey. It's like nice evening weather, so it's actually perfect outside. So I'm kind of pumped. Yeah, it is fun. beautiful. Yeah, it's really pretty. And the view is always gorgeous. I mean, look at this. All right, let's show the cute little basket you have for this the picnic. Is, this is the picnic. Got basket. all the stuff in it. Aww. So Salad cute. and some chips and stuff. Yeah. Awesome. What are you What are you doing for like job, your career? What are you like pursuing? Um, so I am in flight school right now. Mm -hmm. um, I'm training to be a pilot, so I want to be a commercial pilot. So. And uh, you have a twin brother. I do have a twin. And and you're fraternal, right? Fraternal. Yep. We, we look nothing alike, so like mm -hmm. sometimes people can't like tell the difference, or sometimes it's hard for uh, people to believe that we're twins. Yeah, I get that. I meant to say. I get that. <laughs> So oh, I just oh, zoomed in. Okay, I just finished eating my meal. I know you guys are gonna laugh at me that this is finished, but this is finished. I don't know if he kicked it himself, but he's not here. But I'm impressed if he did, because it was delicious. And also he has this like cute little setup of like fruit, and he even brought like lemons to squeeze over the salad, so it was like really bougie. And also sparkling water, which I don't like. <laughs> So I feel so bad because, oh, I'm okay. I really just don't need a drink. He was like, oh no, I have water in the car. So that's where he is right now. He's running to give me water, which I just, ah, I feel a little high maintenance, but that's okay. But the rest of the meal, really great. Having a fun time. Picnic's super fun. We're sitting on this cute little blanket and Betsy's just chilling. Out. She's doing a great job. Oh, that was good. Hey, okay, everybody. Watch and learn. The pro's about to start. Woo! <laughs> Oh, nice! Oh, it's sick! It's sick twice! Thank you. Let's see this. That one's good. Did I get three? Three one. <laughs> I think it was two. <laughs> oh, I think that's the second time I've fallen oh on this gosh. day. You guys, she ate it and I didn't have the camera on. And you literally <laughs> my face like touched the crap. <laughs> That was like five. That's pretty good. That was pro. <laughs> Hashtag pro right here. What else do we need to teach Brooklyn? I mean, do you know it all? All the things? <laughs> she knows all the things already. <laughs> all of it. Come on, pro. Paddleboarding now? I think that's the move. 
What do you guys think about these sunglasses? Turn to the side. Is that a go or, or a no go? Apparently, somebody thought that they were girl sunglasses, right? It's girl specific. Yeah, they're just guys don't wear tortoiseshell sunglasses. I thought that they were like gender neutral. Yeah. yeah. Comment down below what you think. <laughs> should he keep them or should he lose them? Yeah. I, 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 I actually I like, I like think them. they look good. Yeah, yeah. I, think okay. I like them. He did, find, he did find a picture of Brad Pitt wearing it, wearing some. So maybe they are gender neutral. <laughs> I, I think so, but I wanna hear I wanna hear what everyone else thinks. Yeah. Bye! Have fun! Be safe! Three, two, one, jump. Three, two, one, jump. We were trying to take jumping pictures and he lost his shoes in oh. the middle of the jump. So one is over here and the other one is over here. Uh, so he gave up <laughs> and he took his shoes just off. Just going with the bare feet. So we're gonna try some more jumping photos with bare feet this time. <laughs> First impression of Brooklyn? Um, I think she's super cute. She's really fun. Uh, she is really easy to talk to. I feel like we got along pretty well. Had a lot to talk about, so. Expect anything different or? I didn't really know what to expect, to be honest. I came in just kind of blind, just <laughs> ready for whatever. And what? But it's been awesome. Um, favorite part of the date? Uh, favorite part of the date, I think, was the paddle boarding part. It's really pretty up here. It was fun to just kind of chat and hang out on the paddle boards. Awesome. So, yeah. Um, what would you rate the date? One out of 10. Uh, 10 out of 10, for sure. Woohoo. It was awesome. Oh, good. Awesome. Thanks for the interview. Yeah, you're welcome. Brooklyn, first impression. Um, he was honestly so sweet. Like we literally got in the car and it was just like so chill already. Like there was just no pressure. There's like no stress. It was really easy, which is kind of nice. Where, was it interesting to go out with another twin? Have you gone out with a twin before? I don't think I have. First twin? This is the first time I've gone out with another twin. But I think it's a little different because he's a fraternal twin and like him and his twin don't look the same. And so I don't know if they like, and they don't even do the same thing. So it's a little different. So like we talked about being twins for like five minutes, but it honestly wasn't like any different than going out with just someone who isn't a twin, which I thought it would be, and it wasn't. Go figure. Yeah, and he's a pilot. And he's a pilot, which I come from like fifth generation pilots. So we connected on that. That's awesome. Yeah. And so just having fun tonight. I know, it's and been great. You know what I thought was so interesting is he chose a chicken Caesar salad for dinner. And I thought that was like a good choice. Like, I don't feel like guys think of that. Kind I know, of thing. it was super easy and it was cooked really well. Like the chicken was delicious. I don't know if he made it. I don't know if he didn't. I don't know if he bought it, but it was really good. I ate the whole thing. <laughs> it so. doesn't matter, because it, it was good. It doesn't matter. <laughs> we are at the end of a day. Dun, dun, Thank dun. you so much yeah, for was, me out. That was so much fun. Yeah, it was, it was really, super fun. Really nice to meet you. Yeah, good food, good snacks. Well, I want you to know, Brooklyn was so nice that she offered to drive. I did. Home. I'm driving. Also, I just love this car. But it was a fun date, right? Yeah, I thought it was really creative, like the picnic and the paddle boarding and stuff, although the water there, because it's the mountains here. Like in Texas, it's lake water, like with mud, and so it's always warm because the ground is warm. Here, it's mountain water, like snow. So it was, even though it's hot outside, it was freezing. The water was freezing. Betsy wouldn't even touch her toe in it. She was like, nope, <laughs> nope. Listen. I didn't want to, I, I wanted them to have the fun. <laughs> I didn't want to take away from your date, okay? So, yeah, it was fun though. Okay, Brooklyn, I really want to know, like, how did you feel? Like, like, do you feel, like, you know how you'll get that feeling yes. if, it's, if he's the one? Yes. Did you get that feeling? I don't think so. I think this guy was really nice and, and the date, like, was genuinely fun, but I, I, like, I'm so sure that I'm just gonna feel it, you know? I'm just gonna know and I'm gonna, like, want to hang out more and, like, do all those things and I don't know if, like, this is the person for that. Like, I he was so nice, but I just, like, know I'm gonna feel it, you it's know? It's true. I think that it really is true. Because Alyssa even said that. She's like, I would go out with these yeah. guys and they did all the perfect things. They were so nice. Yeah. 
but but if you guys loved him vote for him in the comments because you know that could always help out